Hey there, welcome back. I am glad you're here. My supplies and equipment are listed down below in the description box. And if you like this video, hit that subscribe button. If you want to be notified when I post new videos, hit that notification bell. And likes, comments, and questions are always welcome. So this has to be the oddest video I've made. Um, not really made, it's just it's half spoken and half voiceover. It's weird, I don't know. Um, I thought it was completely a voiceover. I started talking, realized the video was talking to me also, and I'm like, oh wow. So I left some things from the voiceover and I took some things out. So I hope it all makes sense. I think there's a lot of good information in this and happy painting. <laughs> okay, so what I've done is put vineyard and cranberry down and this is i believe sailboat no i can read it sapphire blue sapphire blue okay sapphire blue already mixed up it was already sitting here it's the reason i picked it so i'm gonna put some drops down Usually you would put straight alcohol to activate this. I'm doing the blue. It's still going to activate the underneath, but it's going to have the blue already mixed up. About quarter size. It's pretty big. I'm staying back. Moving just a little bit. More than likely, this is going to be a card, so I'm really not concerned with the ends. Or I'll cut them off for a smaller picture. Now, right here, it started to dip in and start split, so I went ahead and just added some to it because I don't want it to split. I want it to continue a nice round here. I need to do this later at night where y'all can hear the frogs. It was awesome. And last night I had a big old hoot owl. It was, it was hooting. I don't know where it was. It was somewhere in my yard. But yeah, that was pretty awesome. But late at night I would have been eaten up by mosquitoes. So, you know, right now until dark. <clears throat> I'm safe. I'm not real happy with that, but if it's a card, it's going to be narrow, so. 
if you don't want your blue this dark, just dilute it down some more. I also noticed that when I hold my airbrush blowing this way, but I'm really coming this way, see how much wider this is? When you do straight up and down, it's going to force it, not let it get as wide. But if you do this, the air's going this way pretty good, and it'll make it get wider. So play with that. See which way seems to work for you. Oh, geez, do you see what I just did? I absolutely love doing flowers like this because the colors are so brilliant and you don't run out of a color. It's because you've got, you're using the diluted ink. This actually turned out into a really gorgeous card. I glittered the center, of course, and it just it is so cool. And as you put this diluted ink down, it starts to create um, a, a lighter space where it sits on top of the dried, hang with me here. When you put the dried ink down, you dry, and the ink that you put down, you dry. Do and you keep putting the diluted alcohol in the same spot, it starts cleaning out that spot. So now you've got a lighter section then a dark section and then a light section again so it really creates a interesting looking flower because you're putting it you can see it here i'm putting it in the same spot so it's starting to pick up the previous ink and move it over a little bit so that's a pretty cool little look Can y'all hear those locusts? They were real loud far away, like three or four houses down. And as they mm -hmm. come this way, you can start to hear it build louder and louder. Now they're real quiet. There's nothing. I, that. I, think I'm done I don't even this. hear it distance. And I've got trees all the way around my yard, so. They're just not making a sound. But it's so funny because you can hear them work their way up to my yard. It's like the way. Oh, they're doing a locust wave. <laughs> that is that. And I'll show you what it looks like. Now I've got this cut out. And this is a tiny bit bigger than what my card is, but it gives me some wiggle room to trim. Look how cool that is. So, yeah. You don't see all the ugly. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put some black. And just kind of do my circle. 
See those circles right there are showing? Kind of want to knock them out a little bit, so I may just go a little bit bigger just to kind of. But they're not that seeable. There we go. Then I'm going to do some white. Now, something I want to do, I'm not real concerned. I'm, I am concerned. I'm not real, I'm not going to be real picky on this because I'm going to glitter it. to do some black dots like through the center of a petal so if you can see a petal something like that Okay. There is that. Now my favorite glitter. Um, a blue would look really cool on that. It really would. Do I want to do a blue? No, not that. Oh, good grace, right here in front of me. So dark blue, that would be cool. Because some of that white's going to show through. And this is just some, I have no idea where I got it. Yeah, good choice. I like that. So you can still see the white. I'm just putting tiny bits. I mean, sometimes there's not even any put down, but just something else to look at. Very 
can see some of it there. All right. So, y'all go have fun. There you go. That's even better. All right. Y'all go have fun. God bless.